Wow. You still feel like you're just never satisfied, right? I ain't never satisfied. Yeah. But it's just, a, it's a lot more to be done. Mm. Good morning, good morning, good morning. So Rap Radar just announced they have an interview, exclusive interview with NBA Youngboy. Now, if you know, NBA Youngboy do not play industry games. It's hard to get this man to sit down and do an interview. But I think a lot of things changed in his life over the past couple months and years. He was facing time for a gun charge, a bunch of charges he was facing time for. He was running through the backyards of L.A., getting chased by the FBI, where he ended up getting on house arrest, and they put him in Utah. Now, if you don't know, young boy is from Baton Rouge, Louisiana, man, one of the toughest places to grow up in, a lot of poverty, a lot of violence, for uh, no hope for a lot of kids that's going to grow up there, that's born there. So... He was able to make a name for himself and make it out. And he did get into trouble, but at the same time, he's growing. That's what we've seen these past couple months. He had a bunch of kids. He had a couple more kids. It looked like he settled down with one person. I don't know. But he got married, allegedly. And, you know, he just got out of his slave deal from Atlantic and got a bigger deal. I think he got a bigger deal from them or he's... Got a bigger deal from somebody else. So this is probably the most money he ever seen in his life. And he was in house arrest in Utah. And if you know, if you take somebody out of the environment, out of a violent environment where there's no hope, you know what I'm saying? And put you someplace else where it's peaceful. You could think. You could get some sunlight. You don't have to look over your shoulder. There's no police harassing you. It could change your whole mindset. So from that now, we see young boy doing interview with billboard and speaking out more and i'm not saying he's playing the industry games but you know he's talking and and expressing himself more you know what i'm saying maybe he could even get some therapy and deal with some of the internal stuff he's probably dealing with but it's good to see man it's good this is shows you what happens when you give people hope when you give them a chance when you give them something new to see you know what i'm saying yeah, it's nothing in Utah. It's no flashy lights and all that stuff. But you could think and be at peace, which is all people want. You know what I'm saying? So it's good to see him, you know what I'm saying, growing and, and you know, showing this new side of him. At the end of the day, this is what we want for our people. And I'm glad to see. I'm not a big NBA young boy fan, but I'm interested to see what he's saying in this interview. I'm interested to see what he want to talk about. I'm interested to see the growth. So look out for the interview tomorrow with um, Elliot and B Dot and see what he got to say, man. Definitely gonna tune in. Let me know what y'all think in the comments, man. This page is new, so like, subscribe, share this. All you young boy fans, all you rap fans, all you hip hop fans, this is for the culture right here, man. It's good to see. Like, subscribe, share this one.